I'm going to teach you a pretty nifty way to edit a slide background. For instance, I want to get rid of the burn text and the burn graphic here in my Captivate background. So I'm going to go to my edit menu. I'm going to choose copy background. I'm going to switch to Microsoft Paint. I'm going to paste the background into Paint. I'm going to use Paint's eraser tool to erase the background image I don't want. I'm going to use the eyedropper tool to pick up the gray background color next to my edit. I'll use the paint bucket tool now to fill in the background. Last steps would be to select the entire image, copy it, return to Captivate, and paste as background. So I'll do that now with Control A. I'll copy by pressing Control C. Now I'm going to switch back to Captivate and paste as background. And I'll click Yes to confirm. The background image is missing. Fantastic. A quicker technique, save a few steps, would be Edit, find the background in the library. It's this image here. Edit this image directly in Paint. How do I do that? Right click, Edit with Paint. If Edit with Paint is not already there, I can click Edit with and find Microsoft Paint or any other program I want to use as my image editing tool. I've already got Paint loaded, so I'll press Cancel. I'll right click and choose Edit with Paint. This time I'll get rid of the Share image in the background. I'll use my Select tool, grab that selection, I'll get rid of it. Use my eyedropper tool to pick up the gray. Flood fill it again with the paint bucket tool. All I have to do now is exit out of paint and this background is going to get updated. Check it out. I'll click Save. I'll hide this group. Background has been edited. Two ways to do it. Copy and paste into paint, paint back into Captivate, or edit directly in paint.